Hey guys, welcome to Lois's Kitchen, Cooking Made Simple. This is part three of our grill series. And in today's video, we're going to be making herb infused pork chops and mixed vegetable salad. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share this video. Let's get cooking. Okay, so I've got pork chops. I've also got coarse black pepper, some sea salt, my spice blend, which is a combination of onion, ginger, garlic, and scotch bonnet, about two tablespoons of melted butter, all pepper seasoning, pork seasoning, and then I've got some herbs. I've got some chives, some rosemary, some basil, and some cloves. So into my mortar, I'm going to add two coarse black pepper, two teaspoons. I'm going to add a generous pinch of salt, sea salt. Into it, I'm going to add my cloves. And then I'm going to add my basil, chives, and then the rosemary. Just take it off the main stalk. And then I'm going to crush them all together. So what I'm doing is just crushing it so that I have a heavy base. Just crushing or bruising the herbs a little bit. Okay, now I'm now going to combine all my spices together and the herbs and season the pork. So I'm adding two teaspoons of the pork seasoning, two teaspoons of the all-purpose seasoning, and then I'm going to add my heavy blend with the salt crushed, and then to it the base spice blend. And then I'm going to mix it all into the pork chops, just so it's all coated. Okay, so you give it all a good mix and make sure your hands have gone down so you can get all the other pork chops at the bottom of the bowl. And then all your herbs and spices has coated the pork chops nicely. And then we're going to leave it for about 20 minutes to marinate. We cover it, put it in the fridge to marinate for 20 minutes. And then it's going to go on the grill. The melted butter, I'm going to leave it aside. We're going to use it when the pork chops go on the grill and we're going to use it just so it doesn't get um, stick onto the grill. So now 20 minutes is gone. We've left it marinating for 20 minutes. It's now going on to the grill. smelling delicious already these are ready to come off the grill now and we're going to serve it with a mixed vegetable salad Here are the ingredients we're going to be using for our vegetable salad that we're going to serve with our pork chops. So we have lamb's lettuce, rocket, spring onion, radish, shallots, some carrots, some iceberg lettuce, red onion, cherry tomatoes, and cucumber. And then we're going to add a large pinch of mixed herbs and vinaigrette. So I'm going to start off with my iceberg lettuce. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to shred it like that so you can have just bite-sized pieces. You can also hand shred if you don't want to use the knife.
I'm going to add it into the mixing bowl. Add my lamb's lettuce, the rocket, and I'm going to dice the shallots. So bridge hold and just dice them nicely. I want to mix up the colors of the onions so I'm dicing the red onions as well. And then break them up as you sprinkle and distribute them evenly. Then I'm just going to use the bigger side, side of the grater and I'm just going to grate my head. So now I'm going to cut the top and the bottom of the radish and I'm just going to slice them. Now this is our dry mixed vegetable salad done. This is optional. You can add about a large pinch of mixed herbs to this and then your vinaigrette. Or you can serve it straight away as it is. Or you can add your salad cream or any dressing of your choice. So this is our mixed salad ready. I've just done it layered. There you go. Here we have our herb infused grilled pork chops with a mixed salad. Enjoy.